western Kentucky down at Kentucky and Barkley Lakes. It's been kind of dry. Low flows have kind of changed fishing patterns. Typically right now, when there is current, you're going to want to be hitting those river channels for the blue cat. They may just be scattered because there's not a lot of discharge, not a lot of current. So you may have to just kind of fish around until you find them. Cut bait, live minnows, night crawlers are always good. And of course, out there on the ledges also are those big bass, eight and 10 inch rubber worms, deep diving crankbaits. Of course, again, with little current, you may have to search around for them. A few anglers catching crappie still out in the deeper water on the secondary channels are suspended. In the tailwaters, striped bass, white bass, catfish is always good. This is summertime fishing. Be safe out there, stay hydrated, and find a good day to go fishing. Hi, this is Kevin Fry with your Eastern Area Fisheries Report. A lot of good success for anglers with hand fishing for catfish in lakes and streams. Dewey and Fish Trap Lakes are doing well with catches and some good catches from North Fork, Kentucky River. Rainbow trout were recently stocked on June 22nd at tailwaters of Paintsville, Fish Trap, and Martins Fork Lakes. Success for bluegill on bed, still good, but looking for this to slow some, as fish have been spawning good since start of June. Yatesville, Pan Bowl, Fish Trap, Buckhorn, and Paintsville Lakes have had a lot of bluegill fish harvested. Red ear sunfish are in good or fair numbers at all these lakes, excluding the Buckhorn Lake. Hybrid striped bass starting to provide some jump fishing activity in main lake areas from Miller's Creek to the dam at Fish Trap Lake. This is Rob Rolled in the Northwestern Fishery District. Major reservoirs, Nolan River Lake, Rough River Lake, are both more or less a summer pool. White bass and old men are beginning to get in the jumps. Also catching a few white bass by trolling, 10, 12 feet deep around the main lake points. At Rough River Lake, the hybrids are also beginning to get in jumps. The mouth of the tributaries in the main lake, also on down the lower lake around the state park beach area. Also picking up a few hybrids by trolling. You don't want to be trolling any deeper than about 10 to 12 feet deep. Flatheads and channels are active at both reservoirs fish with live bait for the flatheads, any kind of cut bait or commercially prepared bait for the channels. Fish uh, evening hours, early morning hours or through the night. Please remember, be safe. Always wear your life jackets when you're on the water.